Tornillo is more than just a pit stop. It's not just a place that you drive through. It's such a tight knit community. I don't know if you noticed when we were driving here, I saw people sitting in their front yards. I think they were maybe playing cards, having a little Dominoes. cool beverage. I, like I, saw a little bit of I that. love that small town vibe. It's just awesome. And for the people that you know, we've talked to, the community here that we've talked to and, and kind of uh, finding out reasons why to visit Tornillo or, or why they even live here. And it's that small town vibe, right? And uh, exactly. something else that I noticed when we kind of came in is the local little uh, convenience store or supermarket, Don Pancho. That to me has small town vibe written all over it, a community or a, a, an establishment that uh, everyone kind of goes to for all their go-tos, all the necessities that you need. Yeah, Andy, and all of these places have a story behind it, just like Don Pancho. Jonathan Martinez tells us the opportunity to open the store presented itself to his dad 10 years ago. And ever since, they have been serving the Tornillo community. But he also tells us that it's not always about running a store and making money. It's about sharing with the community and supporting one another. Take a listen. Well, I've been helping out with sports. There's, they, they, they have baseball teams here and soccer team. I, I sponsor a couple of them. Um, I try to help them with, I, with what I can. Even on schools, I've, I've helped some of them um, with what I can. That is so sweet. I love hearing, mm -hmm. hearing these awesome stories, but it